when id software released castle wolfenstein 3d it really transformed gaming on dos and when id followed that up with doom that really uh, uh cemented id as the first person shooter and he had a lot of doom clones people were trying to come up with the next first person shooter uh, that really took would take the world by storm uh, and i showed one or two of them here but uh, duke nukem 3d is one of those iconic games that followed in the the doom tradition of first person shooter and it was actually a fun game to play so uh, let's it's something that people have asked for so i wanted to show off uh, duke nukem 3d so let's go ahead and uh, do a demo of duke nukem 3d uh, now here i've downloaded and installed uh, Duke Nukem and uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, run the game which is just Duke 3d I've installed the shareware version here uh, and so you'll see there it uh, says Duke Nukem reg uh, unregistered shareware at the top uh, so a space to get past the uh, these screens and uh, this is a little demo obviously it's going to show me the uh, uh, what's going on let's go ahead and do a uh, new game and uh, it's the shareware version. We only do LA Meltdown. We'll do that. Uh, different difficulty levels. You know what? Uh, I'll be brave. Let's do uh, Let's Rock. The let's standard, rock. Standard difficulty mode. Damn. Those alien bastards are going to pay for shooting up my ride. Yeah. It says those uh, aliens have uh, shot up his ride. Now, uh, that was his little rocket ship that was going down there. Now, I've got uh, different keys that I can use. Uh, I uh, prefer to use the, uh, the keyboard. Uh, so some of you may comment, why not use the mouse? I really do prefer using the keyboard. Uh, so just to kind of uh, orient you here, uh, Control will fire. Uh, Alt will let me do uh, sliding left and right, right strafing. Uh, and uh, uh, A will jump up, a little hop, and Z will sort of uh, squish me down. Uh, you can also uh, look up and down uh, in, uh, uh, by using, uh, uh, using the uh, uh, the home and, and M keys, uh, or if you're uh, using the number pad on a standard keyboard, uh, just use uh, the arrow keys, and it'll feel a little natural. Uh, let's go ahead and, oh, oh, by the way, and shift will actually run. So by default, you're kind of walking around. Uh, hold down shift, you can zoom forward and back. Okay, let's. Uh, I want to get down where this uh, fan is, but uh, uh, the fan's there. So let's go ahead and shoot these explosive objects and get going. Oh, over here is an alien. Let's shoot him. All right. Uh, oh, health. Uh, let's hop up here. And let's hop up there. Now there's a secret over there if I can just get to it. Oh, all right, let's try that again. There we go. And there is a rocket launcher. Awesome. awesome. All right. Uh, now these windows are actually things you can jump through. Um, so you kind of need to know which ones you're going to jump through, but uh, this one is one I want to jump through here. Oop, there we go. And every once in a while you, you'll find these security cameras, so you can actually look at uh, some things going on around around you. Uh, yes, you kind of. This is uh, showing around the corner. You can kind of see in that little shadow there. Um, there's a there's an alien waiting for me. Uh, hit space. You can kind of cycle through them. Uh, this is uh, out in that uh, alley that I just came from. Uh, and this is inside the uh, the movie theater, uh, inside the bathroom of the movie theater, it turns out. Uh, so you need to remember that that guy's up there later. Um, and uh, uh, sort of the back of the movie theater. All right. Let's uh, rock it on. And let's slide over here. Let's shoot that guy. There he is. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get, pick up the ammo. Attack of the beach. Bleached blonde biker bimbos. Yeah, there's a lot of that in this game. All right, uh, let's go through the window here. Ooh, look, atomic health. How many is down there? Oh, I got a couple of friends. Let's use our rocket launcher. There we go. And where's the other guy? Oh, come on! I didn't actually get him. Fine, I will let you just find me later. Uh, there's a crack in that in that wall. Oh, and a friendly guy. Look at that. Right. Let's see if he's. No. Nope. Still there. Come get some. There we go. And let's go back out in the street. Let's go deal with that one guy. Boom over there.
if you had anything. I'm gonna jump in there and into the fire. Yeah, no. Yep. All right. All right. Let's go uh, back into the theater. And uh, this is the main entrance. Now, uh, a great thing in Duke Nukem, as well as a lot of other uh, first-person shooters of that era, uh, you can turn lights on and off. I can turn that on. Um, but nothing's showing up in here. That must turn on the lights on the other room. Let's turn that uh, on. Doors. There's somebody. And there's a shadow of somebody that's above there. So let's go over here. I know it, it, it may feel a little weird to uh, me to be using uh, the keyboard, uh, but you know, back when this came out, I actually played all my games on a keyboard. So this is for me, it feels very natural. Let's go into this room over here. Oh, shotgun! Here's our friend. Pick that up. Oh, little security camera. Gonna cycle me through the same views that we had before. Go out. And someone has shown up over there. All right. He's happy. Ooh, atomic health. There we go. And, um... Oh, hello. Yeah, okay, that closes that. Not quite sure how to get up there, but, um... All right, we'll leave it open. Um, and then here's another light switch. I can turn lights on and off. All right. Uh, just to kind of orient yourself, uh, over here is a theater. Here we got some friends. And let's, let's go back here. There's somebody hiding. All right, let's go back into the theater proper. Hear that? Heard that explosion earlier. That 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 did that. Uh, what's over here? Oh yeah, this is the bathroom. You can see I got a mirror over there. Turn the light on. Um, uh, you can see a guy in the mirror there. So uh, let's go ahead and take care of him when we come on this. Let's take care of that guy. There we go. Oh no! I took care of the uh, urinals as well. A lot of destructible things in this game. Behind the couch. Not that I've ever seen a couch in a men's room before, but here we are. Go back to... Oh, I don't have any uh, ammo. For... Oh yeah, I do. I have 100 points of ammo. Who's in here? Nobody's in there. And he's in here. There's somebody in the bathroom. Uh, here's something that was... I, thought, I found kind of cute at the time. Uh, much better. If I space on a toilet, it will, he will use the toilet and say much better. Well, let's hop up on the sink, hop up there, and we'll sort of scoot across and pick up our first aid. Nope, there we go. Alright, and uh, let's kick in the vent. And uh, let's hop into the vent, because vents are always a great place to go, right? I just picked up some shotgun ammo, so I'll switch to my shotgun. Now over here, you occasionally find these uh, women in these little pods. Um, yeah, they're stealing alien. Uh, the aliens are stealing chicks. Kill me. Press space on that, and she says, "Kill me." So we'll go ahead and we'll take her out of misery. Um, sorry. So here we have some people that are being friendly. Let's try to uh, take care of this guy. Here's another one. And here we have an access key card because of course you do. And that is uh, opening up the movie theater screen. Yeah, I know. It's um, that was the era. Um, and uh, somewhere around here. Oh, oh, I can get atomic health up there. Up there. Oh, what is that? Oh, well, I found somebody in a little secret. Pick up my RPG. And let's go down the stairs. Turn the light on. Um. 
go. And if you recognize where you are, this is the lobby of the theater. Made some new friends. Uh, now let's go into the theater itself. I know we were there before, but now we've opened up the view screen. And anything over there I want to get? Nope. All right. And uh, you can see there's a crack on the uh, screen. That means I can I can shoot it. So we'll push to our friendly rocket. Yeah, I'll make a little hole. Let's uh, hop, up here, hop up here first and pick up the armor. More ammo, because of course you're gonna leave lots of ammo in a the theater. Uh, there's a guy. Right. Up through there. Oh, hello. Him out. Jump up here. Anytime you're in a mirror, press space. Damn, I'm looking good. Damn, I'm looking good. And what's over here? Another view screen. <clears throat> Again, the same views we had before. And we haven't been there yet, so let's go through this window. Ready to play with? Nope. All right. So how do I get up there? I don't remember how to get up there now. Um, go back into the theater. Oh yeah, we go through the arcade. That's right. Here's the arcade. Now arcades were something that um, you know you can go somewhere to play video games, uh, and you had to put in a quarter each time. So if you're um, not old enough to remember arcades, there you go. With these guys. Oops, who's shooting at me? I'm hearing a noise. There he is. And uh, let's pick a hole. Every time we see uh, things to explode, might as well shoot them. Whoa! Okay, maybe I shouldn't have been in the room at the time. Pick up this health. Um, there we go. Uh, now, uh, We've got actual games here that, um, Balls of Steel is one of them, that's a pinball machine. Uh, looks like I can't pick up that ammo, must be full. Uh, and here is a, another arcade machine, and over here is uh, Duke Nukem, Duke Nukem 2! Look at that. Don't have time to play with myself. Don't have time to play with myself, because of course. Mm, don't have time to play with myself. Alright, uh, and then uh, over here we want to use the key. Now that unlocks the door. Whoa! And here we have LA Cop, a pig. Hail to the king. Hail to the king, baby. Alrighty. And if I really, really wanted to, I could jump over there and get that health, but I don't really need to. Somebody though is shooting at me. Where's that coming? There he is. Oh, come on! All right. And I think that should be everybody in the level. So uh, at the end of each level, you're going to find this atomic symbol. Just go ahead and break the glass. We'll, we'll kick it in for one, one final hurrah, and then just go ahead and press that button. Hollywood Holly Cost completed. Um, there we go. Enemies killed 30, uh, 37, and I left two of them somewhere. Um, but there you are. That's the uh, first introduction to uh, the first level on Duke Nukem 3D. Um, this is the next level, but I'm going to go ahead and just stop there. So, uh, what do you think of uh, this preview of Duke Nukem 3D? Are there other games you'd like me to try? Mention those below in the comments, and I'd be happy to look at them. Um, and before I go, I just want to give a special thank you to some of my Patreon supporters. Uh, everyone who uh, uh, supports me on Patreon, you, you really help me out a lot, and you do make this channel happen. Uh, some of you have donated at a higher level, and I want to recognize you here, so thank you very much. And so uh, that's it for today's video. Uh, visit our website at freedas.org. Join us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and consider supporting me on Patreon. Thank you.